Hi, today we're making tofu and kale for dinner. So Noah's going to give me a hand with the tofu, right Noah? Yeah. Okay. Tofu usually comes in a container like this. Of course we like to buy organic and you can recycle this container after. So this goes in the recycling bin. Tofu yeah. generally comes in one large block, right Noah? Yeah. And we put it in the colander to strain some of the liquid out. And then I take a towel and I put the block of tofu on the towel and just press out some of the extra liquid. And I chop it into cubes. And then for this recipe, we cover it in flour, right Noah? Yeah. So do you want to help me do that? Yeah. Let's put the tofu ready. You can dump it, or you can, whatever way you I'm going to dump it like that. Good job. And then you want to stir it up in the flour. So then we're going to make sure all of the pieces of tofu are covered in flour. And Henry needs a pacifier. You want this? No? Okay. Wait, Henry can decide what he wants. Which is always a hazard while cooking with Henry. Because you're never yeah. quite sure. Yeah. What's going to be? Yeah? Yeah. Do you want me to help you cover this with some flour? No. So no, we just make sure each one is covered. Mommy. Okay, excuse me, honey. So back here I have two pans with <laughs> butter, a tablespoon of butter in each pan. And hang on one second, we're just going to figure out what's going on with Henry. We're back. I still have not figured out what's going on with Henry. But we're going to add a little garlic to each of the pans. The recipe asks for onions, but I don't think it needs it. So, well, I'm going to put one clove of garlic in each pan. Okay, Noah? But I'm going to do this by myself because it's hot. Okay, we're just going to shake a little in here. We're going to shake a little in here. All set, Henry. We're going to save the rest of this garlic for tomorrow night. And then we... No, would you want to put, and then we're going to toast the almonds and cook the tofu at the same time. Both should take about five minutes. So, yeah, honey? Yeah, honey? So, like this? Like that. So, Noah, I'm going to put this in the pan, okay? You want to watch? Yeah. There we go. Put all the tofu in there. And then I have chicken broth that I'm going to put in each of the pan. The recipe calls for half a cup, breath in it? but I generally like to use about a cup. You put in the chicken breath? Well, I'll pour this chicken breath in. This is a free-range organic chicken breath. Can I get chicken breath? The, what is it, no? You can make chicken breath? That's right. It's free-range organic chicken breath. I'm going to put a little in here. And then Noah, What's it in there? And then, oh, we can do that too. And then we're going to toast the almonds. We're going to put about a cup of almonds here. You want me to pour the almonds in? Mm. I know, Noah loves almonds. I'm going to pour the almonds in here. We do about a cup. So, the almonds taste yummy before we toast them. But they taste even better afterwards. And unfortunately, Henry, it's a little too hard for you, sweetheart. Right, Noah? Is it a little too hard for Henry? Yeah. Oh, you put it in there? Yeah. Okay, so that's okay. Really, we'd put it directly into the pan. <coughs> but now he wants to stir it up in there, which isn't a problem. Here you go, Henry. Alright, so now I'm going to dump this in the pan. Okay? There we go. So we're going to toast the almonds and cook the tofu for about five minutes. And then we're going to add the kale. Let's stir this up a little bit. There we go. The recipe likes you to um, toast the almonds in the pan without anything in it and put the butter in after. I like to toast you it eat with the almonds. You need a little more? Yeah. There you go. I cut the kale last night because cutting kale is a little labor intensive. <gasps> I use Two bushels of kale. A bushel is about this size. This is our kale, honey. That's the tag that tells us it's organic kale. 
So I cut off the end of the bushel, and then for this recipe, I cut but, off the sides of the kale. Right, Noah? This one. And Noah helped me wash this. So we're going to leave the, the center strips are not going to go in the recipe. These are going to go out in the compost. These are the odd? Well, yes, we put old things in compost, and we also sometimes put new things in compost that we can't use. Yeah. Yeah. Can use this other day? So, yeah, so we can't use that. Yeah. So we put it in the compost, and, oh, there you go. Henry wants a spoon. Henry, here, you can have this spoon. Henry has to be included. We have to include everybody. And then I have a bowl about this size full of kale that I'm going to put in the pan after our almonds are toasted. So, Henry, should we go check on our almonds? Let's take a look over here. Looking what? very nice, very nice. I'm going to add a little olive oil into the almonds. Mommy? I think it gives it a nice flavor. Yes, sweetheart? Our tofu is looking good. I'm going to add. I just added about a half a no cup mind. of chicken broth for the tofu. There you go. Oh, Henry, you're having a little flour. Just, all right, there you go. No, my, what no. You, what are you doing, honey? We'll so while we let that cook, <laughs> I'm going to let them play in that bowl, and then we'll put the kale in a few minutes. Are we ready to add the kale? Okay, now we're ready to add this big bucket of kale after it cooks. Um, really string stem, so it's going to be about a quarter of the size when it's all done cooking. So now are we going to put the kale in with the toasted almonds? Yeah. Is that a big pile of kale? Yeah. It's going to go down? Yeah. Because right now it's a big pile and it's going to go down after we cook it. Yeah. That's right, honey. The big pile. You don't like the big pile? Yeah. We don't like big piles, unless it's big piles of milky, right? Sometimes we like big piles of milky. All right, so we're going to let that cook down a little bit more. We're only about... Now, how long does that cook? It, 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 it cooks down that up. It cooks down that up. It cooks, no. it cooks down for about two or three minutes. When we're all done, we'll put it on the plate. We'll put the kale and the toasted almonds in a... Um, on a plate, and then we'll put the tofu on top, and we're all set. All right, Noah, are we all done cooking? No, but you're eating almonds. You're still eating almonds? Yeah. Well, you can still eat the almonds while no, Mommy's Mom. stirring the kale. No, Mommy. What, honey? Oh, no! Did you spill your almonds? Yeah. All right, that's okay. So, where'd the bird go? He flew up. He flew up there. So as you can see, it only takes a few minutes to make a dinner that the whole family can enjoy. I did have to take the almonds out from Henry, though. He still has a difficult time chewing them. But um, we had a lot of fun making it. We all feel a sense of accomplishment and belonging and togetherness. So hopefully you'll have a good time making this meal as well. And we'll see you next time. Is that yummy, Noah? Yeah. Noah loves kale and tofu? Right? I'm amazing. And you like your almonds also? Yeah. And kale. Tofu and almonds and kale and tofu and almonds. Almonds and kale and tofu. And almonds and kale. Yeah. And Henry likes it also? Yeah. I think so. Henry doing such a great job with the fork, honey. Look at that. What a little guy. I have to give them more almonds too for Noah. You want a little more almonds? Yeah. I'll go to spoon. Spoon. <laughs> I'll get you some more almonds. Okay, thanks for joining us. We'll see you next time.